If you think there's nothing to do in Newcastle and Lawrence County, then think again. Always stay connected to NCTV45 to receive the information on events going on in and around the area on a daily basis. Programs to view are Newswatch, The Morning Show, and Community Happenings. NCTV45 takes pride in bringing you the event and organization info that you want. NCTV45 is the number one media source locally. NCTV45, anytime on your time. Entrusting your loved one to a funeral director is a very personal and emotional decision. The funeral director you choose must understand the importance of the decision you have made. When you call the William and Roger DiCarbo Funeral Home, I recognize what a privilege it is to be chosen at your time of need. We will provide you and your family with the best service possible, with sincerity and compassion. The William and Roger DiCarbo Funeral Home, family owned and operated since 1941. Today's program was furnished by a grant from the Beanery Depot in Delhi, featuring coffee, made-to-order subs, and snacks. The Beanery Depot in Delhi in Mahoningtown. Butts Flowers and Gifts offers top quality flower arrangements and gifts for any occasion. The pros at Butts Flowers and Gifts provide exceptional customer service and each bouquet is hand arranged. Stop in and check out their wide selection of gift baskets and plants. They provide flower delivery service locally to Newcastle, Bessemer, Edinburgh, New Wilmington, West Pittsburgh and across the nation. It's Butts Flowers at 120 East Washington Street in downtown Newcastle. Call 724-652-7727 or toll free 1-800-443-7726. NCTV 45, the train, anytime on your time. Hi, welcome to News Watch. I'm Floyd Jackson. In the news today, Pennsylvania State Civil Service Commission to require uh, veterans only lists be reviewed in all civil service hiring decisions. Uh, in Harrisburg, on the 74th anniversary of the passage of the federal GI Bill of Rights and by unanimous agreement, members of the Pennsylvania State Civil Service Commission voted today to adopt and approve Commission Resolution 2018.1. Chairman Brian Lentz, uh, statutory required veteran member, said the adoption of Commission Resolution 2018-1 will support the selecting and hiring of el eligible veterans for potential merit service that has covered job opportunities. The resolution will promote and encourage state agencies to select qui qualified veterans for available jobs. The chairman's full comments are also attached. The Pennsylvania law provides a legal preference for selecting honorably dis discharged veterans uh, and veterans preference to fill public positions at every level of state and local government. Eligible veterans receive a hiring preference and 10 additional points added to their final uh, examination results. And we'll be back after the sponsor. If you're having a party, then Keystone Specialty is the place you need to go. Yes, they have every party supply that you can imagine. Planning that wedding, that graduation, or maybe it's just that big game that's coming up. Go to Keystone Specialty. Party supplies and so much more. Remember, they have those fall decorations, winter, spring, and summer. It's Keystone Specialty on the south side of Newcastle, Mill Street. If you're craving hot dogs and more, and you're in the area, then look no farther than Coney Island, downtown Newcastle on Kennedy Square.
Chuck Tanner would be proud of the restaurant that bears his name. Chuck Tanner's Restaurant, owned and operated by the Papazikas family, would love for you to be part of a Newcastle tradition. Come enjoy the great breakfast, super lunch, and second-to-none dinner choices from their Italian, Mediterranean, and American cuisine. You can relax with a wonderful atmosphere and something from the bar. If you're planning an event, ask about their banquet facility. Tanner's Restaurant is located at 2305 Wilmington Road in Ushanic Township. Call 724 658 Hello, and welcome back to News Watch. In news, state police uh, seize heroin and other prohibited drugs valued at nearly $15 million in the fourth quarter of the year of 2017. From out of Harrisburg, Pennsylvania, the Pennsylvania State Police announced today that troopers confiscated $14,747,000 $304 in heroin, fentanyl, cocaine, and other prohibited drugs in the fourth quarter of 2017. From October 1st through December 31st, state police seized more than 18 pounds of heroin and over 111 pounds of fentanyl. The drugs have combined street values of $2,269,920. Troopers also removed nearly 181 pounds of cocaine and 34 pounds of methamphetamines valued at nearly $4.7 million from the highways and communities of Pennsylvania during, during the same period. In 2017, the state police seized over $41 million in prohibited drugs, including 227 pounds of heroin and fentanyl. For the fourth quarter drug seizure totals, just giving you some of them, in cocaine, the total seize was 180.8 pounds, valued at $3,290,560. Crack cocaine, 2.559 pounds, valued at $117,845. Uh, heroin, 18.1 pounds, and that's valued. On target printing 1319 West State Street, no job is too big or too small. Turn around on most jobs 24 hours. We make you look good on paper. NC TV 45, the train, anytime on your time. back to news watch <clears throat> we're back and we're talking about rose point park cabins uh, the camping ground is awarded the most creative activity um, rose port point park cabins and camping was awarded the most creative activity from the pennsylvania campground owners association called the pcoa uh, it was a convention that was held at state college uh, the program entry took place uh, the home goal was their wizards, fairies, and trolls uh, weekend where they created and enhanced forest complete with fairy houses. Uh, the description of the entry submission included children partaking in the day's activities with a positions class of making goop, uh, gack, and slime, all made with simple household ingredients of cornstarch, borax, glue, and water. Uh, Walking in Hannet Forest were lush woodland of hemlocks, ferns, and moss, 15 tiny houses made of leaves, stick bark, and stones were found nestled into crooks and tree trunks. After exploring the fairy houses, each launched a uh, wish boat made simply of a candle of a piece of bark into the stream. Uh, the grand finale of the evening <clears throat> at the back at the park was a stunning performance of fire dancers. Uh, Debbie Yeager, owner, exclaimed, it truly was a magical event uh, for campers of all ages. Rose Point Park Cabins and camp it, Camping provides you and your family with a memorable camping experience as full service campground with four-star recreation program. It's more than getting away 
it's getting together. Sounds like a lot of fun at the campgrounds. That's it, and we'll be back after we hear from our great sponsors. Let Clark's Furniture be your go-to destination for all of your furniture needs. Check this out. Seven-piece bedroom by Ashley was $38.69, sold for $27.99. Great pricing on futons made by the Coaster Company. Wind furniture made in America. Great quality. Sofa sold for $547, chair only $397. Seven-piece queen bedroom set by Bond Bassett, all American made. These are just some of the super deals at Clark's Furniture. Located at 346 East Washington Street, Newcastle. Call 724-657-5668. Hello, and welcome back to News Watch. Now let's go to Ann's with Lawrence County 45 weather. It's time for Lawrence County 45 weather, and uh, Currently 57 degrees outside. Now, don't let that fool you. The rain is coming down, and uh, so will the temperatures. Falling around the 36 the rest of the day. So we're going to be starting to lose heat real quick. Now, there will be a wind from the south at 8 to 13 miles an hour as we start to lose that that heat it changes to snow but first we're going to have rain and freezing rain tonight sleep before 10 a.m. so it will be icy be careful in your travels then snow and sleep between 10 and 11 then snow after 11 the low will be around 15 degrees now those snow accumulations will vary People are saying three to seven inches here in Lawrence County. Still likely Saturday, mostly cloudy, 17. Now, new accumulation on Saturday will be about an inch. So Saturday night, slight, uh, slight chance of snow showers, mostly cloudy, low around two. Chance of snow Saturday night, 20%. Sunday. Partly sunny with a high of 16. Sunday night, partly cloudy, a low of 2. Will be chilly in the nights. Martin Luther King Day, mostly cloudy, a high of 24. Now, there is a 50% chance of snow. And uh, Monday night, snow showers, cloudy, a low of 16. Also a 50% chance of snow. As you get into Tuesday, go back to work. School, mostly cloudy, 22. Tuesday night, mostly cloudy with a low of 5. Wednesday, mostly cloudy. Okay, and a high of 18. Mostly cloudy Wednesday night, a low of 6. And partly sunny on Thursday with a high of 21. Now, we're going to we'll keep you abreast on what's happening with the weather as it changes. This was Lawrence County 45 Weather, and we'll be right back after these messages. Today's programming is brought to you by NCTV 45 and NC Radio 450, Newcastle's community television station. Hello folks, Angelo Parada for Ferrone Brothers. Wow, you have to try their food. Great Italian food and two locations on the south side on Mill Street and on Wilmington Road in Newcastle. Ferrone Brothers for pepperoni rolls, pizza, any Italian dish that you can imagine. Okay, and a whole lot more. It's Ferrone Brothers. Stop by, they have those daily specials and they look forward to seeing you. Tell them NCTV45 sent you. A special thanks to the YMCA for caring about the Lawrence County community and providing funding for this program. Hello and welcome back to News Watch. This story's just in and we're gonna bring you more about it as we get more news about it. Uh, getting the word out on January 26, 2018,
the Union School District is uh, rededicating the gym in honor of Coach Mike Cavelli. Uh, it looks really good, and they want everybody to know that they would love to see as many of the old Scotties, especially the ones that are living out of town, uh, if you can make it. Uh, please pass the word and pass it on to other people. Now we're going to take a break with these sponsors, and when we get back, we're going right back to Ange with the rap. Special thanks going out to Town Mall Pizza for sponsorship of this program, located in the Cascade Galleria, Newcastle. Hello folks, Angelo Parada for Ferrone Brothers. Wow, you have to try their food. Great Italian food and two locations on the south side on Mill Street and on Wilmington Road in Newcastle. Ferrone Brothers for pepperoni rolls, pizza, any Italian dish that you can imagine, okay, and a whole lot more. It's Ferrone Brothers. Stop by, they have those daily specials, and they look forward to seeing you. Tell them NCTV45 sent you. Whether it's a scheduled appointment or same-day service, DiCaprio Carpet Cleaning offers 24-7 service for commercial, industrial, and residential, as well as fire and water damage restoration. Using state-of-the-art technology, DiCaprio Carpet Cleaning experts are ready to professionally clean your carpet today. Call DiCaprio Carpet Cleaning for a free in-home estimate. Thank you for making us Lawrence and Mercer County's largest carpet cleaner. And remember, nobody gets your carpet cleaner. NCTV 45, the train, anytime on your time. Well, welcome back. Hopefully you're having a great lunch, and that's it for this midday news watch. We're going to wrap it up right here. Make sure that you get out in the back, come downtown, Stop at the Confluence, get a sandwich. It's a great day to be in Newcastle. So uh, make sure you tell a friend about NCTV45. They'll be glad you did. And by all means, make sure that you have a super day in what I call the greatest castle in the world, in the County of Lawrence. Have a great day, everybody, and we'll see you on later.